The recovery looked to be losing momentum last month. After creating more than 200,000 jobs in April, businesses hired only 41,000 in May, still better than a year ago. But it is nowhere near the kind of growth that we need in order to put the 15 million unemployed workers in this country back to work. The job market is especially tough for teenagers spilling out of high school. I'm hoping and I'm praying I really need a job this summer. Good luck this summer. They face one of the worst years ever for summer jobs. The unemployment rate for teens is more than 26 percent. That's nearly 1.6 million teenagers looking for work. Have you guys been just told flat out, we don't need teenagers this year? No. Yeah, pretty much. At the high school in East Chester, New York, senior Tara Byrne has found work as a ski camp counselor. Yep, out in Oregon. You have to go all the way to Oregon to get a job. But many of her classmates haven't been so lucky. They said, I'll contact you later if I need you, and I just never got a call. At a teen job fair in nearby White Plains, 15-year-old Rebecca Pearl says there's just too much competition. It's hard to get into now because a lot of college students are coming back and taking positions that usually the people in high school would get. So the fact that we're having this real dearth of jobs right now can have lasting effects for this cohort of kids that just don't get that summer experience. And for the typical unemployed worker, the average time it takes to find a job now has reached nearly five and a half months. Katie. All right. Anthony Mason. Anthony, thank you. And